serious questions about what an ex-state cop did and what he's doing now. Good evening. He was a state police officer when a lawsuit claims he sexually assaulted a DWI suspect and then called her constantly. While he's being sued and the state law enforcement board is looking to see if he should wear a badge, another police department hired him anyway. Here's News 13's Crystal Gutierrez. Now, Jessica, it's a hire that has Santa Fe's chief of police backpedaling and ordering his investigators to look further into Officer Carlos Luz, uh, Salazar's past, even though he's already on the force. Former State Police Officer Carlos Salazar, is he currently with your department? Yes, he is. Police Chief Raymond Rael says Carlos Salazar has only been with the department for about a month, but he's already being investigated by the department for what background investigators did not find before he was hired. Had I known uh, the extent of the situation and the referral to the academy, I probably would not have extended that offer of hire. Salazar was recently accused of sexually assaulting a woman he arrested for DWI in 2010 in the bathroom of state police headquarters in Albuquerque. The woman says he exposed himself, touched her breast, and asked for sexual favors. Rael says he knew about the investigation, but... I had no clue of the depth of the allegations. Salazar was suspended this summer and then quit, but state police say the DA did not charge him because of a lack of evidence. However, there's still a lawsuit against Salazar that Rael says he didn't hear about until recently, adding he should have. Do you guys even look at civil lawsuits when it comes to background checks? My background investigators are definitely supposed to, yes. If they had, he may have heard this. Phone calls from Salazar to the woman he arrested for DWI offering a favor. Salazar sent us this statement saying he absolutely did not do what that woman claims, that he passed a polygraph test and an investigation. He added that he made a mistake by dismissing her case and was disciplined for that. The woman's attorney says the dismissal and phone calls alone are unethical and should have cost him his career, adding something inappropriate happened in the station that night. What did he mean by that? What did he mean by he, he thought they hit it off great when he, she was under arrest and intoxicated, allegedly? Santa Fe Police Chief Rael says he only learned that the Law Enforcement Academy Board is investigating Salazar after he hired him. He did not know the specifics of that investigation, and the LEA did not get back to us today. Back to you. Okay, Crystal, we learned the Santa Fe police officer who reviewed Salazar's background has now moved on to a job with state police. A probation officer is accused of fondling a woman he super